let your boy Jackie Simpson check it out because, oh man, not again. Now, Liger Simpson is back with another one. Now, uh, he might actually be catching a back-to-back -back belly flop, and if you don't know, he put out a project a couple months ago called The Gold Album. You probably never heard of it because it went copper. Now, to be honest, only about like 3,300 people bought it. A couple of people listened to it on Spotify, and pretty much it was the weed plate being passed around the Kardashian household, okay? Now, with every musician who flops, okay, that was a seismic Michael Phelps-style belly flop, right? With every musician that flops, man, they do the same thing. They don't want that flop to be the lasting impression fans have of them before they go on vacation or they go booling in the beaches of Dubai or whatever it is. So they instantly rush to put out another project, just like Tiger just did. Now, he's released a mixtape called Fuck What They Talking About, and literally... I'm going to just be honest, man. Tiger, I'm gonna just have a seat. I'm going to just give you some advice straight off the bat, okay? This is from the negotiator, okay? Listen, uh, people don't really fuck with you too much. If I were you, if I was going to put out a mixtape after the everything that's been going on in the blogosphere, whatever it is, man, I would literally just have an intro or a track at least with a hook or a verse, a goddamn stimulus package filled with a moist 16 of Kylie Jenner pussy queefs. I'm sorry. I'm just being honest. Now, I keep telling y'all, man, when you wife a Kardashian, you either become a trophy nigga on her arm or you just got to get her pregnant. You got to get her pregnant like Kanye or that nigga uh, Scott Disick, okay? Now, just being fair, right? Because I took a quick listen to the mixtape. The mixtape does sound better than his album, so if you are going to listen to it, it's not as bad as his album. But what people are talking about is not like any hit songs that are on the album. They're talking about the same thing. Him rapping about his girlfriend. And it's kind of sad because that's the only part about Tyga that's interesting these days. When he's rapping about him and Kylie Jenner. Now, let me actually recite the lyrics. And by the way, it was on a song called Stimulated. Uh, you guys could Google it and check it out. But uh, this is what he says. He says, they say she young. I should have waited. She a big girl dog when she stimulated. Now, those amateur Ice JJ Fish A-Town bars are exactly why people are only talking about Kylie Jenner. I mean, Tyga, you really used to have it when it came to, like, club hits. I'm a, I'm a DJ. So Tyga used to lace the club with hits. But hearing these goddamn bars, I'm like, what the, what the fuck is this, man? It's like a goddamn bunch of, it's like a collection or a playlist of simp ballads, okay? But if you guys didn't get the reference, I'll break it down. He says, they say she young, obviously and clearly about Kylie. I should have waited, clearly insinuating that he ain't waited. I mean, he's been donkey fucking her from who knows when, probably from when Caitlyn was Bruce. And he says she's a big girl dog when she stimulated obviously saying she's a freak in the sheets all right now it's weak bars but that's what tiger has been reduced to a guy who's only rapping about his girlfriend to be honest he's really safari on steroids at this point now tiger man words to the wise man you may not be talented musically like future vandross but just like how he took back the streets after he ditched Sierra, you may have to ditch this chick. And I know you're probably thinking it's your stimulus package, but if you want to be considered serious in your music career, you probably never will be while you're still with her. And that's the thing. You got to make a choice. Do you want to be a trophy wife or a trophy nigga, or do you actually want to stand on your own too? Now, given the looks of things, it looks like you probably want to be the next Lamar Odom. So we'll see where your career goes. As I said, it's a decent tape. It's not whack. It's not whack. It's better than his uh, album. If you guys check it out, let me know what you guys think about it. If you won't check it out, man, just let me know. If it's just fuck Tiger, tell me it's just fuck Tiger, okay? And uh, get in the comment box, give your reviews. Woody Jackademics, I'm out.